All right, so it's day 23. Is it 23? Day 23 of this 30 day vlog challenge. I'm coming towards the home stretch here. Uh, and today, what I'm gonna do is a, we're gonna do like an interview style questions thing. So, uh, all right, here we go. So I have some scars on my face that kind of embarrass me. Um, I have a scar right here. It happened from when I was a kid. I was running with a knife. This is why you don't run with knives. Uh, but yeah, I was running with a knife and I went to go jump over something. I was like five or six years old. And then I, I tripped and cut myself when I fell with the knife. I cut myself and I cut myself right here in my face. And now I have a scar. Um, and luckily it's right where my smile line is, but still it's there and uh, I don't know, it, it just self-conscious vanity, so that, that embarrasses me. And it embarrasses me to even say that. Oh, buddy, why am I single? Oh, man, who says I'm single? <laughs> I, I am single, and uh, I think the reason why I'm single is because I've been through a lot of stuff, man, and, um, uh, things didn't really work out the way I thought they were gonna work out. I guess I haven't really found the one or it's just not the right time. And say by single, it's, I guess I think by single, I would think that that means why am I not married? Not why don't I have a girlfriend? Why am I not married? And that would be, be I think because just, I would say not the right time, more than not the right person, if that makes sense. What would my tombstone say? That's not even something I like to think about. Jeez, that's, that's, that's like kind of heavy, kind of morbid. Um, let me think about that for a second. Follow your heart, live your dreams, never give up. I think one of my strengths is, is being aware of, of kind of what's in my soul and being aware of that and channeling it um, creatively. Weakness, I mean, a weakness, huge weakness of mine is, is just staying focused, uh, my attention span, and um, yeah, just being ADD, straight up. Oh, uh, so my... <laughs> I have a few pet peeves, not a lot. I'm not really a particular person, so I don't have very many pet peeves, but uh, one of my main pet peeves is when, um, is when people don't empty the trash can out, like in the kitchen. Or if they put like, if you have a gallon jug of milk and it's empty and you just stick it in the, stick it in the trash can like without crunching it or anything and it just takes up all the space in the trash can like needlessly, yeah. My favorite smell, um, hmm, marijuana? <laughs> uh, no, it's, I do like it, um, but, uh, hmm, I feel like I just smelled it the other day, too. I have a bad memory, so, favorite smell. You know what, one of my favorite smells are is, and I can't, I can't tell you what exactly it is, but a woman's hair when she's got like a really nice shampoo and I could just smell the scent of the shampoo coming off her hair, that just always kind of gets me. I love that. Today I want to say I'm thankful for my friend Zola because he's hooked me up with so much stuff. He showed me the ropes with Hawaii when I first got here. Uh, I actually lived with, with, uh, with Zola for a couple, two and a half years on the North Shore of Hawaii. And he showed me all the breaks. He showed me the breaks on the South Shore. He showed me the ropes of ghetto, ghetto survival on the, on the North Shore. Just did so much for me. This hat right here, this shirt that I'm wearing, he hooked me up with so many cool threads and just cool stuff like that. And uh, Zola, thank you, man. I'm thinking about you. And um, yeah, I hope you're well. So anyways, other than that, thanks for hanging out. And until tomorrow, I will see you later. Peace.